going to play. I literally, you know how you can feel something? Like it's pushing you around. I put up one hell of a fight, but I'm so surprised my shot is still going on. So my name is Eric Clem, and I'm one of the senior industrial designers part of the Giant Global Design Group. And part of the experience that I have at Giant is a lot of the design and development of the new frames, the new bikes, and the complete experience. So everything from our initial research to sketching to 3D modeling, and obviously working with the engineers along the way to make sure we have beautiful and functional finished product. For 2012, first off just visually, what we tried to do was have a bit more of a family outlook. So we introduced new TCRs, new Defies, and each of those has their own character, but within those characters, there's still a family language going on. So you can see the similarities, and it really brings Giant together, Giant closer together. This is all new for Giant this year. We've had a Defy Advanced in the past, and this is a true performance bicycle at the same level as a TCR Advanced SL. A little bit different makeup to it though. It's not quite for the same experience. So TCR, a little bit race geometry, a little bit different. This one is something that you might see a rider on Perry Roubaix, even on the Rabobank team next year using. A little bit slacker geometry, actually a bit lighter weight, a little less stiff, but it really contributes to a little bit different overall ride experience. The first time you hop on this bike, you'll notice that it's a slightly longer wheelbase than our TCR. And what that really helps out with is, especially in the descents and your stability. So you can really hold your line just that little bit better. From a visual standpoint, one thing you'll notice is just the robustness of the tubes. The down tube, the top tube. There's a bit of a softness there, but it's also sort of a hidden strength. Also the seat stays, much lower for compliance. The shape of the seat tube really stands out and makes it different from anything that we've done in the past. So combine all those elements together and you have something really special, really different, and it really adds to a whole new experience for the Giant Road lineup. For our Road lineup, they are all using Overdrive 2, which is an enlarged lower bearing of one and a half inch and a steer tube of one and a quarter inch. And all the new bearings, all new system, and this is actually interchangeable with our current lineup of 2009 through 2011 bicycles. So the outer shape has not grown, but you could still replace the internal bearings, internal cups, to actually retrofit this to the system. But what this does is it just provides that much more stability up front. So whether you're really wrenching on the bars on a climb, you're sprinting, you're descending downhill, you can really load up the front end a lot more with your own power and it can really help out in certain situations. Gliding around a corner, holding your line, um, it's really, really um, a step forward for us. And something you notice, we have a ISP on our Defy Advanced SL. So, much different seat tube from the TCR. This one is geared more towards compliance, so you see actually more of a D-shape here and then it flows into more of the arrow shape that has become synonymous with our other ISP designs. But yes, it's very easy to, if you know your height, easily cut it within about a minute, put the clamp on, and the new clamp obviously provides many more options for getting the rider fit.